we have learned a lot at least i have learned a lot i hope everybody would have learned something new today it will give some benefit to the patients and to the clinicians we should diagnose the cases and all the physicians should know how to diagnose such cases i just want to know that uh, a frequency from 1 to 20000 hertz that is uh, used in ultrasound number 1 is proximal stenosis number 2 is distal infection what will happen in distal infections hyperemia interpretation of peripheral arterial and venous doppler which was published in vascular medicine in 2020 titled interpretation of peripheral arterial and venous doppler or 90% your reporting is ethiopia mein perforated segment uh, jo loop kaise banna hai loop is between the varicose or superficial vein then the perforated and then the deep vein na there are patient who has undergone the surgery proper surgery and their sapropheminal junction are untouched they have not even been explored there is a big long incision there but sapropheminal junctions are untouched so there is some problem somewhere it's a weak area from all the sides you know from surgical side from radiology side you should always comment on the deep veins whether there is a reflex in the deep veins or not because it has an implications and you should always comment in the great saphenous vein reflex even there is a competent sapropheminal junction and there is a reflex in the great saphenous vein then there will be indication for intervention and similarly with the short saphenous this way and same is true with the perforators you should exactly locate the site of the perforators and see the reflex positive reflex or not there's no need to mark the perforators but if there is a reflex in the perforators that needs to be treated in different ways but not surgical suspicion ki yahan arti hogi to main wahan usko comment kar lu ya main needle dal ke garad dalne ki koshish karu that should not be attempted actually aur iske sath kafi sari jo hai complications reported hai Section, section, position of your hand to the probe will 
where you would see the results, immediate results, long-term results. So what are the consequences? So yes, if certain things look good today, then we have to see how they are going to be in future as well. So what are the results? If they are good enough, yes, they can be used. Laser surgery has been tried for coronary lesions as well, for calcified lesions. So yes, if they can give good results and consistent results, we can use them. Dr. Shahbaz Sarwar, Dr. Liaqat, for Dr. Ilyas Sadiq, Dr. Javeria Jamshed, Dr. Navera Rao, Dr. Avaiz Shuja, Dr. Avaiz Shuja, Dr. Nayab Asif, Dr. Arham Amir, Dr. Hifsa Habib, Dr. Asya Fazil, Dr. Faika Saleem, Dr. Safiya Mushtaq, Dr. Aisha Khizr, Dr. Nimra, Dr. Iram Mukhtar, Dr. Areej Fatma, and Mr. Amir from Videography, for Sonotech for Doppler Machine, Dr. Asif from Surgery Department, a certificate for Dr. Shahriyar Forum, Dr. Muhammad Ali, Dr. Anna Salsubil, Dr. Ubaid Surgery SR.